Saucy friends, welcome back. I know it's been a minute since I've been on here. Uh, well, at least since the uh, health scare that I had. Just a quick update on the health issues. Uh, I went into the hospital as I posted before and I was. they said it was AFib. Um, I'm not sure, 100% sure, again, if that was exactly what happened. But um, since then, it was recommended that I... Um, drop my alcohol intake um, dramatically and um, also to try and attempt to eat healthier and lose weight and such. So I have pretty much completely changed my diet. Um, I have been dabbling in some hot sauce here and there just to make sure everything's good with that. Uh, doctor said I shouldn't have to worry, just try and stay away from the high sodium, uh, obviously, and watch my sodium intake every day. Um, again, no alcohol. Uh, this actually is a beer, but it is Budweiser Zero, uh, so it doesn't even have 0.5 in it. Tastes like you're drinking a Bud Light, but there's no alcohol in it, so it doesn't affect me, which it is what it is. I got to do what I got to do. Uh, other than that, um, I did the sleep study, which I ended up walking out of, um, got home very late in the morning because I couldn't sleep with all that shit on me. Um, I'll post a little picture. Uh, it was fucking ridiculous. Um, the conditions were not even close to what I would generally sleep in. Um, other than that, I did, uh, wore a heart monitor for two weeks and then, uh, on January 6th, I have a echocardiogram, uh, ultrasound on my heart. And we'll figure out what the fuck is going on from there. So until then, I figured I'd jump back up on the horse. And uh, Happy New Year to everybody out there. Hope it uh, brought you in good health. Um, yeah, hopefully this fucking year is better than the other. Um, that being said, courtesy of Hot Sauce Mike, card up in the corner. Going to be doing Johnny Scoville's CTH1 Hot Sauce Pineango. Taste the heat. Let's fucking get it. Alright, so as I said, we're doing a CTH1 Pine Ango. Chase the heat. Uh, Blazing Foods. What is that, sorry? Blazingfoods.com. I'll put a link in the description as I always do. Says, caution, extremely addictive hot sauce. Heat level is only 3 out of 10. So hopefully the flavor is what it says it is. Um, as far as the ingredients on this one go, we've got mango, pineapple, distilled water, mango puree, fresh ginger, fresh Vidala, Vidalia onions, key lemon juice, key lime juice, Carolina Reaper mash, Fresh Carolina Reaper, peppers, vinegar, white wine, white wine vinegar, sorry, kosher salt, turmeric, basil, and spices. All right, let's see what this stuff smells like. It smells very, oh, very, very strong mango scent with a bit of a pineapple kick. Oh, that actually smells pretty tasty. All right. Let me just pour some of this on my uh, popcorn chicken and uh, we'll get right at her. Alrighty, <clears throat> so we got to pour it out. It's kind of got the consistency there of like a, like a, what a plum sauce would be or something like that. But it uh, smells fucking fantastic. Like I said, you get the strong mango uh, with a bit of pineapple there and the spices. Alright, here we go. Let's try it out. Thanks again, Mike. That is pretty tasty. Actually, it's very tasty. Um, you do get a little bit of a kick to it uh, due to the Reaper mash and stuff, but again, it's not that hot, uh, surprisingly. Uh, you think a Reaper mash would actually be hotter than this, but um, no, very mild burn on the um, back of my tongue, back of my throat type thing right now. But um, yeah, definitely nothing unbearable, uh, especially for being a Reaper mash. That's actually kind of shocking. Um, yeah, I've had habanero sauces that are way hotter than this, but uh, flavor-wise, definitely very good. You definitely taste the mango. Pineapple's a little bit more subtle than the mango is it itself. Definitely get a bit of the vinegar, but not too bad. 
Um, no, that's a fucking, that's a fucking tasty sauce, actually. I'll, uh, definitely enjoy killing this one off. And I'm curious to try a few of the others. I know, um, they got a bunch of other ones that, uh, are in these bag type things, which is kind of funny because this, uh, reminds me of just being in the hospital. It reminds me of like a fucking, like an IV bag or something. Just took it to my veins! But anyways, yeah, definitely a tasty sauce. You definitely, uh, mango is definitely the highest presence as far as flavor goes. Uh, vinegar, very subtle. Uh, pineapple is there, but the mango kind of overpowers it for me. Um, yeah, fuck, all around tasty sauce. Again, I believe that's Johnny Scoville. Um, chase the heat, blazingfood.com. I will leave a link in the description. Um, hopefully, I'm going to be banging out some videos more regularly like I used to. Um, but yeah, so far, folks, I'm in good health. I've lost myself a good 12 pounds from where I used to weigh before. I've been eating healthy. My blood pressure's good every time I check it. So all in all, let's just cross our fingers and hope that echocardiogram goes pretty good. And hopefully it's nothing too serious. Otherwise, fucking love all y'all. Again, thank you for joining me. Um, more videos to come. Again, Happy New Year. And I, let's, let's just pray that the year 2022 is blessed for all y'all. All right? Peace.